Hello, gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm. Fairy Vixen here, back again on your Wednesday. Today I have a new box, and it's a brooch box. So if you love bro brooches, uh, stick around. Um, if you see something you can't live without, please do leave a timestamp in the comments below of the item or items in which you're interested. Or if you would rather, you could send that same information to my email, which is in my description. But if you do that, please include the title of the video and the date that it was posted. Um, uh, that way I can find your items. And if you have not bought from me before, include your name, address, PayPal, email, and YouTube name. That way I can match up your names. Get your items out to you and get them in the mail to you as soon as possible. I invoice at $50. When you hit $50, you may no longer claim items in my comments until you have paid the $50. I will hold on to your paid items uh, if you so desire, and we can work out when and how and all of that in email. All right, I do have a question for Peaches. If you're out there, please send me your info. You have a whole bunch of cool stuff that you claimed uh, yesterday in my life, and I don't have your info to send it to you. So, please, uh, if any of y'all know her, let her know that I need her info, okay, okay? Um, alrighty, we're going to get started with this beautiful box of brooches. I, get... I started to open it, but it was so much wrapped up so much that I had to uh, I had to stop and start the video over because there's just too much well let's be careful so we get stabbed uh, you may have seen some of these already on another channel but oh look at that we got a bunch of these that things. Oh, wait. I've seen her before. There's some neat ones in here. Oy. Hold on. Alright. I think what we're going to do is... Oh, wow, look at him. I'd like to sort them into specific groups, but... I don't know that that'll work. Ouch! Stabby. Ooh, look at this one. Wow, that's crazy. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm saying, ooh, look at this, and you're not even looking at any of them. This is a beautiful little uh, poinsettia wreath. Unmarked. We'll do it for five. Let's do the fives first. This one is beautiful. It's a starfish. In beautiful shape, unmarked. Oh, wait, no, it's marked. <laughs> it's marked and it has, um, it's contemporary, I can tell. Uh, it says, oh, it's a contemporary Monet. Very nice, very nice. We'll do that one for six. Ridiculous, ridiculous. This is a mid century one, unmarked. Very cool. We'll do that one for five. These guys, I don't know about these guys. These guys are weird. This one is unmarked, but it's resin. It looks like a Hallmark one, but it's not. So we'll do that for two. This one is the same kind of thing. We'll do him for two. This one has a, is signed on the back. And it is made Mary Engelbrett Inc. Inc. We will look her up. I'm not sure about her. Hold on a second. Let me bring this over here a little better. Can't hardly reach. Okay, we have a couple of um, a little bit beat up mid century flower brooches. Are there any more of those in here? I don't think so. 
Um, but I'm going to do the pair of those. The pair of these for $4. They're, they're nice for crafting. You can spray paint them and give them new life. Very cool. They go for a pretty penny when they're not all banged up. But the four for the pair. This one is big and bold and black. And sparkly. Look at the sparklies. So it's got like little gray stones. It's got some white. That's a really nice one on your winter stick. This is a good one for on your winter coat. I love putting a brooch on my coats. I need to switch them out. I have so many coats upstairs with, with brooches on them. I need to. I can't remember what has what. <laughs> Alrighty. So this one we're gonna do for six because it's big and beautiful. Alright. Oh, look at the kitty. Oh my goodness, so cute. I'm feeling a little better now that I'm doing this. This, this is adorable. A little kitty cat on a cushion. Amazing. Oh, and it's a 1928. Look at that on the back. If you ever see that on the back, even if it's not marked, that will tell you that it is. Uh... 1928 beautiful we're gonna do her for eight she's beautiful Ooh, speaking of vintage florals this one is gorgeous and it's set with little plastic stones so I'm gonna say this is um early 60s it's got the riveted back and it has the vintage V yeah oh that's stunning we'll do that one for eight too stunning stunning this is handmade I don't know what this is I don't know I don't know what that is but it's signed it looks like it was the kind that you bake clay, clay bake. I'll do that for two. Ooh, this one. Vintage. Oh my gosh, it feels yummy. Uh, it does not have a name on it, but it is definitely a vintage piece of fine quality. It's beautiful and heavy and nice, for, even for how small it is. We'll do it for seven. Oh, here's a little metal one with applied sparklies. I don't know if you can see the sparklies. No, it's not showing you the sparklies. Hold on. There you go, now you see them. And they have like a gold sheen to them. Red gold. It's not showing up on camera for some reason. But I do see a name on the back of this one. This one is Danecraft. Danecraft, we'll do that one for seven. Danecraft is a nice vintage name. Oh my gosh, look at you. What? My, 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 my. BSK. Oh, these are gorgeous. Oh my gosh, BSK. That's a great name. Let me stick that in there. And it's got a venturine and a pearl. Is that pearl real? No, it isn't. But it's a little peach with a leaf. It has a couple of teeny little dings here, but that's very minor for the age of it and the brand. I'll do that for seven. It's a shame it's got dings in it. Oh, this looks like Sarah Coventry. Mid-century. Nope, Trafari. It is definitely a mid-century piece, though. 
Al Jafari, we'll do that for seven. Good Lord, Miss Agnes. This one doesn't have a name on it anywhere, but it's a big old C. I guess you could wear it as a C. Or just a, a horseshoe partial circle. I'll do that one for four. Oh, look, another vintage circle. Vintage circle bro brooch. I have so many of these. It has a cartouche, but the cartouche doesn't have anything written in it. Whoop! Whoop! Slippery. We'll do that for four. Do, do, do. I'm going to get through this box pretty quick, I can tell. Kitty cats. Kitty cats on a park bench. This looks like a JJ, but it's not. It is a... Hold on. It's an art. Art or something. It's adorable. I do that for seven. Oh, another mid-century. Mid-century brushed silver tone. I love this style. Look, I love this style. Isn't that cool? The brushed with the uh, with the shiny. So nice. This one, does you have a name on you? It's also Trafari. I think Trafari did a lot of this brushed with the brushed and bright. That's adorable little swoop. Swoop, swoop, swoop. We'll do that for five. Oh, here's another cute little flower. It has a little pearl in the middle. The finish is, oh, it's not the finish. It looks like it has, it's made to look like it has dew on it. That's amazing. Unmarked. We'll do that for five. Five. Oh, here's a group of butterflies, unmarked. Very pretty pastel colors, peach, green, and cream. I have a coat this color. It's a spring coat. Hmm. Hmm. I'll do that one for four. <laughs> I inherited a lot of great coats from my grandmother. <gasps> Look at this one. What the heck? <laughs> okay, I'll do that one for two. Somebody made that. That's crazy looking. Weird. Weirdness. I've seen this one before in different colors. It's unmarked. I knew it was going to be unmarked. I think this is a, a modern, a brand new modern one. It's got pink and peach and lots of sparkle. Little, Are they blue or are they white? Oh, they're AB. They were looking blue for a second. I'm going to do that one for five. That's beautiful. <clears throat> Beautiful. Oh my gosh. It's a cowboy boot. I might need to send that to my sister. It's adorable. Might need to. Unless someone else wants it. If you want it, you can have it for five. This one looks like a, a vintage one too. It's a little, I don't know what you would call that. It's a little spiky spike, a little spiky guy. We'll do that one for four. And this one is painted. Watercolor painted. It's vintage. It's silk. 
That's very pretty. That's painted silk with some sparkle. We'll do that one for four. A little feather. Vintage. We'll do that for four. Oh my lord, look at this one. It's huge. And it's from, it's a Monet. Look at that Monet. It's huge. It's as big as your hand. Gorgeous. Definitely 60s. Very mod. We'll do that for eight. Oh, grab that one by the stinger, huh? Almost got it. Almost got stabbed. It's the thing about big bags of brooches. They tend to bite. This is a little <clears throat> enamel rose, little white rose, little white rose. Doesn't white rose means innocence, doesn't it? We'll do that one for three. Move this stuff out of the way. Come on, get out the way. This one, then we have to look this one up. There. Let's stuff out the way here. Oh, here's another one that's very much vintage. It's a grape leaf with a little flower. Nope. No name. We'll do that for three. Oh, look at the little bow. You know he wore it, wears a lot of bows. Royalty. Miss Queenie. She's gone. She's gone. I hate to think of Camilla wearing her jewels. Ugh, God. Ugh. Beautiful. Pretty, pretty. We'll do that one for three. Little ones, little ones. Oh, look at the little gingerbread man. Pewter, very cute. I'll do that one for three. Another little mid-century circle pin, unmarked, three dollars. Oh, look at these. These you could wear together. These are leaves. White enamel leaves. Do you have any more of those? don't see any oh my gosh I'm gonna do the pair of these for for seven dollars because they go together they totally go together they're both mid-century seven for the pair <laughs> oh this is a JJ missing the mirror that's a shame do that for a dollar since it's missing the mirror. I don't know if the mirror is in here. This is a handmade one. Melted together. Little plastic pieces. It's got a, a stag and some trees and a heart. And the moon peeking out from behind a tree. That's kind of cute. Kind of a mess on the back, but they did a nice job. I'll do that for two. <laughs> Cookie Monster. Muppets Inc. So that's the real deal. Gonna do that for six. I'm sure you can get it for more, or sell it for way more than that. Oh my gosh, look. It's a black lab. Oh, I might have to keep that. But if you want it, you can have it for three. Teeny tiny butterfly for three. Vintage. Ooh, look at this one. That's a fancy heart. A 
Look at the sparkle. And this one says, ah, aha, 2008, Chico's. So that is a Chico's holiday bra a bra a bra a brooch, it looks like. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. We're going to do that for 10. Because Chico's. Here's another mid-century piece beautiful in perfect condition for six there's an earring i don't know how that got in there <laughs> look it's a spirograph remember those another really nice uh mid-century circle pin i had a collection of these and i i think i i think i got rid of it i don't, I don't remember We'll do this for five. Oh, here's another one. It's just a... Uh, very modernist... Concave or convex oval. We'll do that for four. It's heavy. Filigree gold, butterfly, five dollars. Oh, what are you? This is another plastic one that somebody made. Modern, ultra modern, brutalist, funky, funky, funky. We'll do that for three. Another little. mid-century circle this one happens to be signed I'm gonna say it's a Sarah Ugh, can't read it can't read it can't read it let me flip it no this one is Jerry's G-E-R-R-Y-S do that for four. Ouch! Ouch! Dang it. They got jabbed. I knew it was only a matter of time. These are kind of... Tell you what. I'm going to do all of these kind in a lot for like five bucks. Okay? There's two more already in there. If you want all three of these so far, whatever else I find that's like this will go in that lot for five, okay? This one is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, look at the... I can't even... Let me go down on this one because it's got these uh, pressed glass. They look terrible, but they're... They're like, can you see that? They're like moon glow, but they're textured. And this is one of those ones that is uh, riveted on the back, so that is old. We're going to do this one for 10 as well. I can't, I can't show these very well. They're, they're really different. Awesome. Okay. We've got some more leaves. Some more leaves, little leaves, little tiny leaves. Aren't they cute? Um, feeling pretty good. I might actually be able to do that uh, working Wednesday video. Um, I might do a video. I might not do it live. Once I get to doing it with uh, Leanne, I'll do them live, but. I might record a little bit of me making jewelry after this. But you'll see it before this, which is kind of confusing. But whatever. This one for three. Also, you can make me an offer on any of this. Like if you want, if you collect circle pins and you'd like all of those 
for a price, just leave me, send me an email, you know, however you want to do it. I am cool with that. This is pearls and rhinestones. Some of the pearls look like they're lose, they've lost some of their shine. We'll do that for two. Oh my gosh, more circles. Circle, circle. Oh, here's another one of those. Oh, wait. Oh, one of these. Oh, that's a separate one. That's in beautiful shape. All right, here's an angel. Mm, okay. First, we'll show you this. Beautiful poinsettia. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Christmas is coming. Vintage. Gorgeous. Not a single ding anywhere on that one. We're going to do it for nine because it's stunning. All right. Three dollars. And do we have a name? No, we don't. This one feels like steel. We'll do that for three dollars as well. Cycles, cycles, cycles. Oh my goodness. Look at this one. It's got like champagne, CZs, and it's another aha. This is the year before this one. So these two are both Chico's aha. And I kind of figured that when I pulled it out. So this is the same price as this one. They're both 10. 10, 10. <gasps> A moon. Moon. Oh my gosh, I need to keep this one. Blue enamel and sparkles. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Mine. I got it. I got to keep one at least. Oh, look at this fancy kitty. Black kitty with a very triangular head. That is so cool. It has a name, it has a mark on it, but I can't read the mark. I can't, I can't see the mark. But look at him, he's so cute. We'll do him for eight. He's very fancy. This one for two, uh, this one will go in the, in the lot with the other Christmas ones. Um, what's this? Wow, look at you. This has a bunch of stuff hanging off. Hanging off it. Woo! There, let's get it all straightened out. It's a fan and it has a gondola. A, what are you? I don't know. A closed fan. A fan. A coin. And a Buddha. That's got some fun stuff on it, huh? And that one, being as odd as it is, I'll do that one for eight. Weird cells, usually. Oh, here's another circle. That's a pretty one. It's big. That looks like a BSK. But it's not. It's a Monet. Do that for eight. This looks like a Monet as well, but it isn't. It is a little butterfly with pearls, and the pearls are faux, but there's no loss of uh, finish on the pearls at all. We'll do that one for five. We only got time for a couple more. Oh my goodness, look at this one. It's butterflies and it's very sparkly. Look at that. That's a brand new one, I can tell. It's like that circle pin that was in there. Very brand new, spanky new. Very brand spanky new. We'll do that one for four. That's going to do it. That's about, eh, about half of this. Maybe a little more than half. Um, I would like to back this off a little. Hello, not in, out. What? Uh, there we go. 
I would like to thank you all for coming. Please leave a like. <laughs> leave a like. Leave a comment in the down there. I love reading your comments. I love answering your comments. So please don't be shy. Um, and if you have any questions or any offers or any kind of anything like that, please send me an email. Email's in the description. Remember that I love each and every one of you. And be yourself. Because everyone else is taken. Bye-bye.